Hey, Jeremy Pittman here again. In our last video, uh, we covered the most commonly torn tendon of the rotator cuff. But in this video, I'm going to share with you how to find out what grade tear it is. Um, most importantly, can it heal without medications, injections, or surgery? So there are three grades of tears of tendons. Um, grade one, it's just a mild strain of the muscle of the tendon uh, without any actual tearing. The fibers just get a little stretched, but they're not really torn. Um, you know, typically Mother Nature will heal those grade one strains within nine to 14 days. So if you're still having pain in the shoulder beyond 14 days, then it's most likely because it's beyond a grade one. So what about a grade two tear? Um, grade twos involve, involve like partial tearing of the muscle tendon or um, the fibers, but they're really painful, particularly in directions of movement that further strain the muscle or make it, make it stretch a little bit more. And these produce a stabbing pain. Now, grade twos are also known to cause pain or increase pain at night, uh, making it very difficult to find a comfortable position in bed and laying on that side is just out of the question. Well, what about a grade three? Um, grade three stands for complete rupture of the rotator cuff tendon. Now, you know you have a grade three when you can't raise your arm overhead anymore without hiking your shoulder like this. So what you're probably doing is using a trick motion to elevate your arm because the torn muscle or tendon itself can't raise the arm anymore. It looks like that. Surprisingly though, grade three tears don't produce a whole lot of pain from movement. Um, the main issue is usually severe weakness of the arm. So here's the good news and the bad news. You know, bad news is grade threes, they can't heal on their own. Typically the only option is surgery. Uh, but the good news for the grade twos is that they can be healed. Uh, but the people with grade two tears make a very common single, most common mistake uh, that makes their condition go from a grade two to a grade three. Now we'll cover this uh, particular thing that they do uh, in the next video. So I'll see you then.